Greetings out there in YouTube land. This is Morris Mann, and as always, I thank you guys for coming to my channel. And today we're going to do another how to play. And today's selection is Sade, Your Love is King. I believe I mentioned before that, you know, Sade is one of my favorite groups of artists because uh, the music is extremely simple, which not to be confused with, you know, bad because this stuff is real complex, I mean, real uh, simple. And it's effective, you know, uh, groups like Earth, Wind & Fire, I love them, but you have a hard time getting through their songs. And I personally kind of feel that they wrote them that way to say, hey, I can do this and you can't. But that's just my thoughts. But anyway, uh, love and jump at the chance of when we're in a band playing Chardet or Chic tunes because they're real simple, real effective. And uh, this song here is real simple. It's just two parts, and that's how I like to look at things, uh, two parts verse, chorus, and whatever else. And in the verse, it's just two chords. A major seven, then the D major seven. That's all she's doing, doing the verses. Then the change where it says, touch the very part of me is B. And what that is is, B minus seven, C sharp minus seven, B major seven, back to C sharp minus seven, then it's B minus seven, C sharp minus seven, then it ends with that cycle on the D major seven again. You know, love is king. That's the whole song. And what I'm gonna do is uh, right quick, but I'm gonna say this, cause gotta say this in every video. These videos are designed for people that can already play and know about chords. They just don't know the chords to the song. Uh, this is not a how to play your guitar video. And I'm not gonna go into put your finger here, put your finger there, because uh, that's for beginners. And I do again have DVDs, over four and a half hours of, of four DVDs where I walk you through the basic chords that you need to learn. And then I do show you where you put your fingers. Uh, when you purchase the DVDs, which is $27, you get this chart. And this chart is kind of the, the key. If you can just learn seven to eight chords with two different inversions, you can play 90% of the stuff on the radio. Uh, just like I said, this chart comes with the DVD package where you just gotta learn the major chord, the minor, the seventh chord, major seventh chord, and suspended fourth, and about three other chords that I teach you on my DVDs, and you can play all this stuff that I'm showing you. Because again, uh, if you are a beginner and you're trying to quote unquote learn a song, that's not the proper way to go. What you want to do is learn the basics and then apply the basics to the songs you're trying to play. Because uh, it's not going to be effective if somebody just teach you one song. Just like now, if I'm about to show you this, it's just all you know. You don't know why you're putting your fingers here or what these chords are named. You don't want to go that route. You'd be dabbling. What you want to do is pick up the uh, DVD the learning package. Again, uh, four DVDs over four hours, close to four hours of me showing you the basic chords, study those, and then apply them to the songs that you're trying to play. So, you know, forgive me for sounding like a broken record, but for every video that I do like this, I have to explain that so people can differentiate between uh, knowing how to play your guitar and just kind of mimicking somebody's finger placements on the neck of the guitar. The second one, you don't want to, that ain't the route you want to go. So uh, I'm gonna put this CD on, but of course you can't hear because of copyright issues. And then I'm just gonna stop when I get to, to the change because that's all she does in this, this song. She goes back and forth from the verse to the change. And doing the sax solo is just the chorus in the verse, which is A major seven and D major seven. Just the rhythm is a little changed, but it sounds different, but it's the same chords. So uh, I'm gonna put this on and play up to the beginning.
And believe it or not, that's the entire song. It just repeats itself. It's a three minute and 42 second song. And then, uh, you know, doing the sax part again, you're just playing uh, the, the chords for the verse. A major seven, D major seven. So hope this was informative, real simple tune, real cool jazzy tune. I love Sade stuff. And the chords that I'm giving you are the actual chords from the songbook. So I'm not guessing or just, you know, I think this works. This is actually what's on the printed sheet music. So on that note, I'm going to sign off. And as always, I hope that this has been helpful. And I appreciate you guys' support. And hopefully the new format will work for you guys. I mean, I personally like the old format playing alone, but, you know, can't do that anymore. And I've had people say that they prefer this better because they can hear the guitar without any, anything in the mix going on, so they can hear exactly what I'm doing. So, you know, actually this does work for that purpose. And again, uh, these videos are geared towards just giving you the chords. It's not, a issue. It's not a video where uh, I'm trying to teach you how to strum or the time and anything because that's something you have to work out on your own. And of course, that's not something that I can teach you in a six minute video. So until next time, take care. Thanks for watching.